This is the 20th anniversary of, of BNL. I'm a massive fan. It's one of my favourite events of the year. I've made some fantastic friends along the way over the years. I think we've been 18 years coming. Yeah. I've written down about 16 pages of notes. It gives you a great opportunity to catch up. It sets us thinking, it sets us challenged on finding new ways of doing business. Well, my relationship with Weller is, is amazing. You know, they're like a brother or sister. It is a family, and I know they say Weller family, and now I've experienced that, and now I'm part of that Weller family. One, obviously, it's a very uncertain world between security threats, uh, between the economy, between Brexit, and, and all these macro issues. I think the, uh, the most important thing for entrepreneurs or even top execs in companies are to be agile and adaptable. I want them to remember to really engage with their customers and build customer trust. I think there's a rush for everything to be digital and actually in fact it's where the digital meets the human that I think the magic happens and you can make a more human connection with your customers. So in my presentation I touch a lot on psychology and um, the human sort of innate um, motivations that cause us to behave in the way we do and how as marketeers we can capitalise on these things. What I'd really love them to take home is the feeling of how to build a picture. How to build a picture that's interesting and provocative and that will last. People consistently ask me how I come up with ideas, how do you stay fresh etc etc and I think the emphasis isn't on how you come up with ideas, the emphasis is on how you synthesise information, how you keep your brain open to the world and the more experiences you take on, the more you're willing to learn from people, um, I think the more knowledgeable and the better at your job you become. Understand what sort of leader you are. Uh, there's Thatcher, there's Blair, there's different styles that I've known and dealt with. Be optimistic about the world. There's, there are tremendous advances in science and diplomacy uh, and medicine all going on. We should be optimistic, but ready for a lot of uncertainty in the years ahead. People need to be educated as to the dangers around them in order to take the necessary steps to protect themselves. A lot of people, uh, they are not having the chance or, or, or they don't have the will or they don't have the guts to make their dream uh, come true.